Sussex University have made a huge commitment to honeybees. They've established this laboratory and hired me, and indeed I'm the only professor of apiculture in the UK. The honeybee is a really important animal in agriculture. In Britain it pollinates crops worth about £200 million a year. So without the honeybee, many of the things that we eat would either be not available or more expensive. In the UK, the honeybees are facing several problems. The main one is diseases, and the second one is a lack of forage, a lack of flowers to collect the pollen and nectar on which they feed. Here at Sussex University, we started the Sussex Plan for Honeybee Health and Wellbeing. This is a five-year plan with four projects aimed at helping the honeybee through creating hygienic disease-resistant bees, finding out where bees collect their food, and combating several of the diseases that honeybees face specifically. The Sussex Plan will help beekeepers in several ways. One is that we will determine how they can control specific pests, in particular the Varroa mite. Beekeepers are responsible for keeping their hives alive and having good management. But where does good management come from? We believe that it will come from good science, which will look at how to combat these pests so that the beekeepers can follow good practice as determined by research. The honeybee colony has amazing communication between the bees and one of the communication methods is the waggle dance. There she's waggling her abdomen. She's been foraging, she's got food. She's telling the other bees in her colony where they can go to find the same high quality food because I've decoded these dances and I know that it's indicating a large field of oilseed rape about a quarter of a mile from here. So in essence, what we're doing is we're getting the bees to tell us what parts of the landscape they like so that we can make more of it. What we're facing is a gradual decline in the number of beehives. At the moment, it's not a disaster, but I think it's a wake-up call. We need to do something to reverse this decline in the number of beehives. And ideally, we'd like to see the number of beehives come back up so that we have a healthy population of beehives in this country producing honey, pollinating crops. <laughs>